Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Options Trader today. As we have seen that the gold has raised to a level of 1657.30. Okay, and if you look at this chart, what we have seen that this particular level, a level of 1640.14, is a strong support. From there, we have seen the gold price has moved upside. Okay, and if the level comes again to this particular level of 1644 then there is a higher probability it can break break this particular level and can go down okay or if this level sustain there is a higher probability that we can see it can move further upside towards a level of 1690 and then further upside if the price sustain above this level okay before we move forward and explain you how the price of gold can move in the next two days you can mail me at stockmarkettradinglive@gmail.com and one more mail id in the description for any doubt as well as our telegram link i have given in the description you can join that too okay now look at this particular chart what we can see that there is a pattern forming if you look at this particular pattern we can see that it is moving in a descending order downside okay and i have already explained you that there is a huge volatility we have seen in the price of gold okay so if the price of gold didn't sustain this particular level there is a high probability of moving further low towards a level of 1649.95 dollars okay and if the price move below that level then we can see it can touch a level of 1642.94 okay and this particular level is a weak support so probability is very high we can see it can fall further down and a probability of moving further low towards a level of around 1613 will be there Keep this in mind. If the price didn't sustain a level of 1642, then there is high chances it can touch this particular level 1613. Okay, and once if it goes below a level of 1613, then we can see if this level didn't sustain, we can see it can move further down. But there is a probability we can see a bounce back at this particular level. But the next support we can see is coming again towards a level of 1640. So once the price touch this particular level, we can see a bounce back towards. further upside and it can touch a level of 1640 again and after that what we can see it can fall further down towards a level of around 16 1596 if the price didn't sustain a level of 1630 13 okay and then further down if the price didn't sustain that particular level also and towards a level of 1586 dollars also we can see for the price of coal but if the price sustain this particular level what we can see okay because there a swing we have seen a formed at this particular level and a strong support we have seen so probability will be high that if the price sustain this level we can see it can go further upside towards a level of 16 65.56 dollars okay and if the price move above that level then there is higher probability that we can see it can go and touch a level of 1672 dollars okay and once the price goes above that particular level then there is a high chances that we can see it can move further upside and can touch a level of around 1687 dollars okay again i repeat if the price sustain this particular level we can see it can touch a level of around 16 61 dollars and from there we can see it can go and touch a level of around 1665 okay once the price goes above that level 1665 and is sustain then there is high chances that we can see it can move further upside towards a level of 1687 keep this in mind if the price sustain this level then a probability of touching 1687 is very high and then if the le level sustain above that then there is a probability we can see it can go towards further high and can touch a level of around 16 1687 to a level of 1697 dollars okay once the price goes above that there is a higher probability that high chances that it can go towards a level of 1706 and from there we can see it can go further high towards a level of 17 18 and then from there we can see it can move further upside okay but as we know that market i have already explained that market is quite a volatile quite volatile so you have to understand that it is the gold price is moving in a volatile range so if you are investing for a longer view 5 10 or 20 years there is a good thing you can invest for a longer view but if you are trading you have to be careful because most of the people lose money in trading okay so you have to set yourself for a day as well as for that particular trade okay so that you should not wipe out of capital because most of the people lose money because they don't understand where to stop okay this is what i somewhat i teach in my workshop how to overcome all these things and if you want to attend the workshop mail me regarding that and we can work out on the timings so hope you like the video and if you like the video please give a thumbs up and if you new to my channel please subscribe